streaming live now on News8000.com. You're watching WKBT Lacrosse. This is News 8 Now at Noon. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us for News 8 Now at Noon. I'm Alexandra Carter. Winona State University students are putting their best work on display today, sharing research projects and internship experiences from the past year with the community. More than 200 students are presenting findings from their projects, which span a variety of disciplines. A co-chair for today's showcase says the presentations are a way for the students to develop communication and other skills needed once they graduate. Vice President Kamala Harris will travel to La Crosse Monday, marking her third visit to the Badger State this year. She'll appear at two events in La Crosse, one focused on abortion rights and the other on the economy and health care. The Biden campaign hasn't released many details yet, including where or when the vice president will speak. But when those details are released, we will let you know on air and on our digital platforms. <music> Hey, good Thursday afternoon to you. Boy, another wet day and gloomy day across the region. Now, uh, we are on a nine-day streak of above-average high temperatures, though. That 61, barely above average yesterday, and that was kind of deceiving. That was set just after midnight. Most of the day uh, we spent in the 50s. And today, tomorrow, and Saturday, I am looking at uh, below-average high temperatures, even on Sunday as well. Uh, it's been a wet morning. We've got cloudy skies, some very light rain and sprinkles around the La Crosse area right now. These light showers will continue for another couple of hours. Breezy and cool tomorrow and Saturday. In fact, frost and freeze potential uh, both uh, Saturday and Sunday mornings of this weekend. Now you can see the rain uh, primarily from central and uh, areas south and east of La Crosse. Those of you in Eau Claire have seen very little rainfall, uh, but this rain will continue, as I mentioned, through about early to mid-afternoon. Temperatures currently in the mid-40s to around 50 degrees, and they're not going to rise much more. Maybe highs around 53 or 54 here in the La Crosse area. I'll have the rest of my eight-day forecast. That's coming up in just a few minutes. All right, Bill, we'll see you then. Google has fired 28 employees who protested the company's cloud computing deal with the Israeli government. The workers reportedly staged protests inside Google's offices in New York and California this week. This morning, a Google spokesperson said the workers refused to leave the premises and had to be taken out by law enforcement. The group that organized the protests, No Tech for Apartheid, condemned the dismissals and accused Google of valuing its contract with the Israeli government more than its workers. A company spokesperson said Google Cloud supports numerous governments around the world, including the Israeli government. The U.S. House could vote as soon as this weekend on foreign aid bills to help Ukraine, Israel, and the Indo-Pacific. The National Security Assistance has been stuck in Congress for weeks now, but it comes at a critical time for U.S. allies. Natalie Brand has the latest for us from Washington. Come to order. House lawmakers are meeting Thursday to discuss a long-awaited aid package to provide U.S. allies with critically needed funds. The plan includes three separate bills with more than $60 billion in security assistance for Ukraine and $26 billion for Israel. Another $8 billion is pegged for the Indo-Pacific with the goal of countering China. It is urgent that all of the friends and supporters of Ukraine maximize their efforts. Speaking with foreign ministers at the G7, Secretary of State Antony Blinken and his Ukrainian counterpart urged the House to act. Support the supplemental that will literally, without exaggeration, help save Ukrainians from Russian missile slaughter. House Speaker Mike Johnson is in the difficult position of trying to sell the package to House conservatives. I'm doing here what I believe to be the right thing. Um, I think pr providing lethal aid to Ukraine right now is critically important. Georgia Congresswoman Marjorie Taylor Greene has already threatened to trigger a vote to oust Johnson over the Ukraine aid. On the other side of the aisle, Democrats are criticizing the speaker for inaction. We knew this moment was coming. He knew this moment was coming. You know, it's never too late to do the wrong thing. But it costs lives, the fact that he's waited so long. President Biden has indicated support for the package. Speaker Johnson hopes by putting separate bills on the floor, it will increase the chance of passage. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Washington. And a fourth bill focused on GOP foreign policy objectives proposes a U.S. ban on TikTok and tougher sanctions on Russia, China, and Iran.
President Joe Biden is set to receive endorsements from a storied Democratic family. Several members of the Kennedy family are attending his speech in Philadelphia today. They've been trying to distance themselves from Robert F. Kennedy Jr., who has launched a third-party presidential bid. One of RFK Jr.'s sisters, Carrie Kennedy, will introduce Biden at the event today. According to the Biden campaign, she'll declare Biden a champion for all the rights and freedoms that her father and uncles stood for. The Kennedys are concerned RFK Jr. could undermine Biden's chances of defeating Donald Trump. In about a month, cicada noise will be in full swing, and experts say this year the noise will be louder than usual thanks to a rare emergence of cicadas that hasn't happened since the 1800s. Parts of southern Wisconsin will experience these periodical cicadas, which only emerge every 13 or 17 years. It's a cycle scientists don't have a clear answer for. They're referred to as broods, and more than a dozen states will experience these two types of cicadas at the same time. One entomologist says the double brood will create a much louder and at times annoying noise. Say a grove of trees behind us with singing male cicadas, that might be in the range of 70 to 80 decibels, which could be similar to a vacuum cleaner. But if you are really close, it could be more in the range of 90 to 100 decibels, which is really, really loud. While the noise from cicadas can be a little disruptive, overall, they do produce some environmental benefits, like being a valuable food source for insects and other predators, and improving water filtration into the ground. And speaking of summer, as summer gets closer, you already know the importance of sunscreen, but with so many options, how do you know which ones will keep you safe and which ones will leave you feeling the burn? Consumer Reports investigates after the break. I worked as a truck driver for 36 years. And then one day I got this letter. Your retirement will be cut. Will be cut in half. You don't forget something like that. Every paycheck we put money away. But because of Wall Street greed, boom, it was gone. But Tammy Baldwin saw what they were doing and wrote a bill to save our retirement. Then she fought like hell to pass it. What Tammy Baldwin did for our families, you don't forget something like that. I'm Tammy Baldwin and I approve this message. You just have to get in the seat of a John Deere 1 Series tractor. Not because of how easy it is to use, or because of our expert dealers. Not even because it has implements for every job. You just have to get in the seat, because breaking ground on your dream home feels pretty great. Visit Tractor Central, take a seat, and see for yourself why nothing runs like a deer. Start now at TractorCentral.com. Spring has sprung, the grass has riz. I wonder where the furniture is. At King Furniture, of course. During our spring clearance event, save an additional 10% off our already low prices. Plus, take advantage of 0% free financing. Recliners, sofas, sectionals, dining rooms, and more. With our huge selection of in-stock furniture, low price guarantee, and free delivery, why shop anywhere else? It's the King Furniture Spring Clearance Sale. Thousands of our heroes face the difficult choice between keeping their heat and power on or facing homelessness. 21,000 Wisconsin veterans are living below the poverty line, many impacted by physical or mental health challenges. Wisconsin loses three veterans to suicide every week. Together, our mission is to provide all struggling Wisconsin veterans with a critical survival safety net that keeps them safely in their homes. You can make a real difference by providing a donation to the Wisconsin Heat and Housing for Heroes Initiative. With 95 cents of every dollar donated, going directly to those right here in your community. Help by visiting www.heatforheroes.org or by calling 1-800-891-9276. That's 800-891-9276. Welcome back. No matter what you're doing outside, remember this. Wear sunscreen to protect yourself from sunburn and skin cancer. You don't need to pay top dollar to find a sunscreen that works, but as Consumer Reports explains, you do need to choose carefully since some of those claims on the label might leave your skin and your wallet burnt. Consumer Reports sunscreen testing is no walk in the park. Experts test dozens of lotions, sprays, and sticks to ensure you're protected if you take that walk yourself. 
we're looking at how well a sunscreen protects against two kinds of UV rays, UVA and UVB, which can cause skin cancer, skin aging, and sunburn. To test for SPF, the sun protection factor, and a measure of how well a sunscreen protects against UVB rays, testers apply sunscreen to small areas on panelists' backs before they soak in a tub for 40 or 80 minutes, depending on the sunscreen's water resistance claim. The area is then exposed to simulated sunlight. The next day, trained experts examine the area for redness. To test for protection against UVA rays, testers apply sunscreen on plastic plates, expose them to UV light, and then measure the amount of absorbed rays. We found considerable differences in performance, even among sunscreens from the same brand. In particular, we found that some sunscreens don't match the level of protection that's listed on their label. A top sunscreen lotion from this year's tests, Coppertone Water Babies Lotion SPF 50, which outperformed its labeled SPF in CR's testing. USERN Advanced Hydration Spray SPF 50 was the best spray sunscreen. On a budget, Equate Walmart Ultra Lotion SPF 50 is CR's most affordable recommended lotion, while Trader Joe's Spray SPF 50 Plus is its most affordable recommended spray. Remember, no matter what sunscreen you choose, how you apply it matters. For lotions, you should use about a teaspoon per body part or area not covered by clothing. And for sprays, apply enough that your skin glistens, then rub it in. This is David Fazekas. And remember, it's also important to reapply sunscreen every two hours and immediately after swimming or sweating. That wraps up your afternoon consumer news. As we head to break, here's a live look at the New York Stock Exchange. Stay with us. More news is next. It's Kubota Orange Days. Shop the year's biggest selection of Kubota equipment and get 0% APR for 84 months or up to $3,300 off select compact tractors. Visit any of your local Johnson Tractor dealerships in Menominee, Baldwin, Osseo, and Arcadia. You're thinking about new windows and doors. I've been thinking about new windows and doors for over 40 years. You're thinking about the best window at the best price. I'm thinking about the best window at the best price for you the best quality installed by professional installers at a fair price. If you're planning new windows and doors, you owe it to yourself to contact the Board Store Home Improvements for a prompt free estimate. You'll be glad you did. Contact us today. You want to provide something safe and reliable, something that won't break down when they need it and is there to support them in the good times and bad. Purchasing a vacuum is like buying a car. You want the best for what you pay for. A vacuum you can depend on to last years. Don't settle for a cheap big box model when you can get a vacuum that is made to last and does exactly what it needs to do. Visit A1 Vacuum Sales and Service. A1 Vacuum, our business is picking up. It's Kubota Orange Days. Shop the year's biggest selection of Kubota equipment and get 0% APR for 84 months or up to $3,300 off select compact tractors. Visit any of your local Johnson Tractor dealerships in Menominee, Baldwin, Osseo, and Arcadia. Hi, everyone! You ready for more of that good news? Yeah. It's a day. I've got the champ on one side and the legend on the other. This is your family. You're not anywhere else other than right here, and I feel that. I suggest starting your day off with a dance party. Of course we're dancing. Turn you time into true time. We make this show for you wherever you are. Just take it with you. Weekdays at 3 on News 8. A new study out of the UK finds talking about ways to quit smoking during lung cancer screenings can save lives. About half the people who have lung cancer screenings are smokers, so researchers say it's the ideal opportunity to discuss programs and other ways they can kick the habit. Deeper sedation may help find difficult to detect polyps during a colonoscopy. Researchers in Maine found 
propofol-based anesthesia is more effective for doctors trying to locate these so-called serrated polyps. They believe the deeper sedation may increase muscle relaxation, allowing for improved inspection of the colon. The harder your brain works at your job, the less likely you may have memory problems later in life. That is according to new research published in the online issue of Neurology. It shows cognitive stimulation during middle age is linked to a reduced risk of cognitive impairment after the age of 70. The study shows teachers have the highest cognitive demands. Those were some of today's top health headlines. Here is a live look now from CityCam 8. The gloom continues. Bill is up next with a look at our forecast. At Ashley Spring Semi Annual Sale, you can spring into savings with Hot Buy $7.99 and under. Plus, shop our Spring Sofa Sale with 0% interest until April 2029 on in store purchases. Hurry in and meet the all new Ashley today. We've all seen what's happening at our border. President Biden and Senator Baldwin's open border policy has brought more than 10 million illegal immigrants into our country. That's double the population of Wisconsin. Our country was already struggling to provide housing and health care to our citizens. And tragically, we're losing over 100,000 Americans a year to the drugs that pour over our open border. Their policy is wrong. I'm Eric Hovde. I approve this message, and I'll work to fix this problem. To everyone who enjoys a feel-good meal, we're crafting one for you, Wisconsin style. We're talking handcrafted, cooked to order, scooped to perfection goodness. More like greatness. <laughs> a snuggle up in the booth, share a bite kind of meal. A fill you up, heart and soul kind of meal. Come treat someone you love to a meal they're sure to love. One always serve with a smile. That comes from the heart. From Wisconsin with love. Welcome to Delicious! It's time, time to get out and rediscover Ho-Chunk Gaming Black River Falls. Grab your friends and play for the day, or two, or three. It's time for you to win, laugh, and enjoy. Over 650 slot machines, tables, bingo, great rewards, delicious food. Ho-Chunk Gaming, just what you need. Get out again and experience the difference at Ho-Chunk Gaming Black River Falls. Meet the all-new Ashley. Discover new styles in remodeled stores, offering everything you need to create inspired spaces from our store to your door. The new Ashley. It's the love of home. Is it time for new windows or doors? Contact the company who has done the research for you. The best windows and doors installed by the best people. Clear Choice Window and Home Solutions. Get your tickets for their gone. Visit MidwestHorsefair.com. Hey, welcome back. It is Thursday, so the latest drought monitor released today. Now, no changes from the previous report, but I want you uh, to draw uh, your attention to, uh, as the data only goes through Tuesday morning, uh, the 16th. So since then, remember, we had the strong thunderstorms later in the day on Tuesday, and then some more rain yesterday and uh, uh, t today, in fact, as well. So many spots have seen anywhere from an inch to two and a half inches or more of rainfall since this data was released. So there could be some improvements uh, as we head into next week's drought monitor. Just wanted to point that out that the data only goes through Tuesday morning. All right, allergy report, low symptoms today again from the rain showers and they will increase the symptoms that is as we uh, dry out over the next couple of days. Also the winds will crank up. Uh, we've had plenty of wind lately and We'll continue to see breezy conditions, especially tomorrow, and still breezy on Saturday. If you need to mow, today's not the day, as that rain will continue through mid-afternoon. Tomorrow and Saturday will be dry, uh, but breezy and cool, with highs both days only around 50 degrees. So, still some light rain falling in the La Crosse area. 50 the high so far, 42 the low. Averages are 61 and 39. Another 0.17 inches of rain has fallen uh, since midnight last night. So, again, it continues to be a wet week across the region. Light rain. 50 degrees right now, both at the airport and downtown. Uh, the Mississippi falling a bit, 6.36 feet. Eau Claire, 50 degrees. You've been drier because you're on the far northern fringe of this shield of rain. And the Chippewa River is rising up to 762.1. 
Now, temperatures are rather cool. You can see where there's a cold front right about here with 60s and 70s uh, to the south and east of it. But locally, temperatures range from the mid 40s to right around 50, maybe 51 degrees. Winds out of the west today at about 5 to 15. Not overly strong, but that's going to change again as we head into tomorrow. So a quick look at radar showing those rain showers uh, bisecting the area from northeast to southwest. So Eau Claire, you've kind of been out of the rain, maybe just some sprinkles there. And this activity will continue to attract to the east and southeast over the next couple of hours as that cold front moves through. That's going to take the rain showers with it, but also crank up the winds for our Friday. Sky tracker showing the rain showers lasting another couple of hours here in the cross, maybe a little bit longer far south and east. Uh, clearing tonight, that's going to lead to a chilly night tonight and then tomorrow some sunshine to start, but then clouds roll in for the afternoon and again those gusty west to northwest winds 15 to 25 gusting to 35 miles per hour. Rain tracker showing just another couple hundredths of an inch of rain possible in La Crosse, a little bit more to the south and east. Zone forecast showing those cool temperatures today uh, in the lower to middle 50s for most. In fact, most of our 65 communities between about 50 and 56 degrees, maybe even a 49 in the Cashton area. So for this afternoon, rain showers, light showers for another couple of hours, otherwise cloudy and cool, 54. Clearing tonight and chillier, lows in the mid-30s, even some upper 20s in parts of Monroe and Jackson counties. Uh, 50 and windy tomorrow, still breezy and cool on Saturday. Notice those temperatures near the freezing mark, both Friday and Saturday nights. Warmer Sunday, 59, and then some low 60s Monday. Another chance of showers later Monday into Monday night and continuing into Tuesday as well. And temperatures, for the most part, stay near or below average over the next eight days. Alexandra? All right, Bill, thank you. Coming up, a chilling Super Bowl mystery after Jason Kelsey's Super Bowl ring vanishes in a pool of chili. We'll dive into the spicy details of this bizarre tale after the break. It's the Bobby Bones Show. Wake up to friends every single morning. Amy is honest. You train like you're a professional athlete. You never know when I'm going to get the call into the big leagues. Yeah, but how old are you? If she doesn't agree, she tells me to my face. Garth Brooks, number one. George Strait, number one. She's got your back, but she will also check me if I need it. Yes. It's just a lot of fun every single morning. Totally agree. Come hang with us. Join me, Bobby Bones, every weekday morning starting at 6 on Kix 106.3. I'm Clint. I'm Phil. Saving you big time money on honey and tea. 12 ounce bargain bee honey, just two for five dollars. Or 20 count bigelow tea, two for five dollars. I caram the hot, hot prices on honey and tea. Bargain bee, two for five. Bigelow, also two for five. Enjoy honey and tea season and save lots of money. Better, better products, products, better prices, better, better service, service because we're employee owned. It's good men's. It's here. The new Modular One Ultimate Seating Solution at Home Furniture. Okay, so you're shopping for a sofa or sectional. You want a perfect fit. So how exactly do you do that? Well, the Modular One does exactly that every time. Choose from six versatile functional pieces starting at $4.49 in five great colors. Pick what you need, combine, adjust. That's it. Your room, your way. The Modular One, exclusively at Home Furniture. Celebrating 70 years, we're News 8 Now. Thank you for watching News 8 Now. Expect more. Taylor Swift fans just can't calm down this week, but don't blame them. The singer is releasing her 11th studio album tomorrow. Swift shared a teaser of the tortured poets department on social media. Fans know the clip is probably riddled with Easter eggs. It shows a peek inside a fictional literary, literary society and a timetable of the release schedule. A calendar reveals a music video set to drop at 8 o'clock Eastern time tomorrow. The mastermind has also been posting snippets of lyrics ahead of the release. Fans believe the new album 
will explore her heartbreak after splitting with actor Joe Alwyn. And the Kelsey brothers have both won Super Bowls, but it appears only one of them still has the ring. Retired Philadelphia Eagles center Jason Kelsey says he lost his bling during a live fan event last week. The brothers held a show at the University of Cincinnati, complete with zany events. One of them included participants digging through a pool of chili to find replicas of Jason's 2018 Super Bowl ring, but the actual ring was also in the pool and now it's gone. Kelsey said people sifted through the chili. They even used a metal detector, but no luck. He says he has already filed an insurance claim, something you don't want to lose. Stay with us. We will have one more check of your forecast when we come back. Isn't it time you turn your backyard into the oasis you've always wanted? Come to La Crosse Fireplace Company and find your outdoor setup. Imagine gathering with family and friends around your wood-fired pizza oven. Sit back and relax around your new fire table. Available in different sizes and styles to fit your lifestyle and budget. Stop in this month and receive 15% off all in-stock outdoor products. La Crosse Fireplace Company, because your place is outside by the fire. Do you suffer from burning pain, coldness, numbness, tingling in your hands, legs, or feet? And worst of all, balance problems? Have you been told you have peripheral neuropathy? Stop what you are doing because there is help in a healthy way. We see physicians across the country throw a drug cocktail approach at this condition, getting minimal, if any, relief while neuropathy progresses toward being confined to walkers and wheelchairs due to amputations and disabilities. Drugs like gabapentin, Lyrica, Cymbalta, or opioids are designed to hide neuropathy but not fix it and often come with dangerous side effects. Finally, there's a proven path to recovery that thousands of patients just like you have experienced. Our breakthrough non-invasive neuropathy treatment is supported by FDA-cleared technologies based on published clinical evidence, creating a 99% satisfaction rating. More exciting, our patients enjoy our home therapy to conveniently accelerate healing. If you want your health freedom back, don't choose to suffer any longer. Call now. Spots are limited to the first 20 callers. Call today so we can help in a healthy way. Spring has sprung, the grass has riz. I wonder where the furniture is. At King Furniture, of course. During our spring clearance event, save an additional 10% off our already low prices. Plus, take advantage of 0% free financing. Recliners, sofas, sectionals, dining rooms, and more. With our huge selection of in-stock furniture, low price guarantee, and free delivery, why shop anywhere else? It's the King Furniture Spring Clearance Sale. The 8000 Plus app. Stream on your time. Get the day's news in your inbox. Email newsletters from News 8 Now. Sign up today. Go to news8000.com slash newsletters to get started. Still some light rain showers for another couple of hours before they shift to the south and east. Temperatures uh, generally in the 50 to 55 degree range this afternoon. And boy, spring kind of stuck in neutral for the next uh, several days. 50 tomorrow and Saturday, quite windy tomorrow as well. Overnight lows near the freezing mark. Upper 50s to low 60s Sunday into Monday. Chance of showers later on Monday. All right, Bill, thank you. And thank you for joining us for News 8 Now at Noon. We'll see you back here tonight. Until then, have a great day.